Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Saibel Explains. This video is all about the visibility rules for 3, 6, and 9. Okay, let's start with the visibility rules for 3. Which of these three numbers, 246, 812, and 931, are divisible by 3? If the sum of its digits is divisible by 3, then that number is divisible by 3. Okay, let's check 246. Let's add all its digits. This is going to be 2 plus 4 plus 6. That is 12. This is 12. Is 12 divisible by 3? We will just divide 12 divided by 3. The answer is 4. So that is 12. If there's no remainder, it means this whole number, 246, is divisible by 3. Let us have 812. 8 plus 1 plus 2. That is equivalent to 11. 11 is not divisible by 3 because if we're going to divide it, that's only 3 times 3, that's 9. We have a remainder of 2. So it means 812 is not divisible by 3. How about 931? 9 plus 3 plus 1. 9 plus 3 is equal to 12 plus 1 is equal to 13. If we're going to divide 13, let's see if it has a remainder. Divided by 3, that's going to be 4 times 3 is 12. Yes, we have a remainder of 1. So we can say that 931 is not divisible by 3. Now let's have divisibility rules for 6. Which do you think of these three numbers is divisible by 6? How will we know that a number is divisible by 6? A number that is divisible by 6 if it is divisible by both 2 and 3. What do we mean by divisible by both 2 and 3? It means it has to be an even number and it is divisible by 3. We know that a number is divisible by 3 when we add all the digits and if the sum is divisible by 3, then that number is divisible by 3. So let's check all these numbers that we have here if it is divisible by 6. Okay, let's identify which of these numbers are even. So it means this 2,742 is an even number and 6,190 is also an even number. And we are sure that 3,975 is no longer divisible by 6 because it's not an even number. All we need to do now is to check these two numbers if they are divisible by 3 by adding all its digits and check if the sum is divisible by 3. Let's start off with 2,742. That's going to be 2 plus 7 plus 4 plus 2. So 2 plus 7 is 9. 9 plus 4 is 13. 13 plus 2 is equal to 15. So, is 15 divisible by 3? Yes, because the answer is 5. It means this 2,742 is divisible by 6 because it is divisible by both 2 and 3. How about the second number, 6,190? We will add its digits, 6 plus 1 plus 9 plus 0. 6 plus 1 is 7. 7 plus 9 is equal to 16. If you're going to divide 16 by 3, it has a remainder. So, if you're going to divide it, 16 divided by 3, that's going to be 5. 5 times 3 is equal to 15. 16 minus 15 is equal to 1. So, it has a remainder of 1, making this 6,190 not divisible by 6. And that's it. And now we have divisibility rules for 9. Which of these numbers is divisible by 9? How will we know that a number is divisible by 9? We will know that a number is divisible by 9 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 9. What do we mean by that? 
it means it is just like divisibility rules for 3. We will just add the digits and then try to see if the sum is divisible by 9. Okay, let's start off with the first number. Let us add the digits 7 plus 0 plus 5 plus 6. 7 plus 0 is 7. 7 plus 5 is equal to 12. 12 plus 6 is equal to 18. If you're going to divide 18 by 9, the answer is 2. It means it has no remainder. We can say that 7056 is divisible by 9. So it's easy. Let us now check the second number, 7371. So that's going to be 7 plus 3 plus 7 plus 1. 7 plus 3 is equal to 10. 10 plus 7 is equal to 17. Plus 1 is 18. So this number is also divisible by 9. Because 18 is divisible by 9. Next, let's check 7205. That's going to be 7 plus 2 plus 0 plus 5. 7 plus 2 is 9. Plus 0 is 9. 9 plus 5 is equal to 14. 14 divided by 9. Let's check if it has remainder. That's going to be how many 9s are there in 14? It's only 1. 1 times 9 is equal to 9. Subtract, that's 5. It means it has a remainder of 5, making this number not divisible by 9. So we're done. Let's have some exercises. Let's just check the column if it is divisible by 3, 6, and 9. Let's have number 1, 81,750. Is it divisible by 3? Okay, let's try if the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. 8 plus 1 is equal to 9, plus 7 is equal to 16, plus 5 is equal to 21. Is 21 divisible by 3? Yes, because 21 divided by 3 is 7. It means this is divisible by 3. How will we know that number is divisible by 6 if it is an even number and if it is divisible by 3? It means this number is divisible by 6. Is this divisible by 9? When you add it, the sum is 21. It is not divisible by 9 because 21, when you divide 21 by 9, it has remainder. So it means this is not divisible by 9. Okay, let's have number 2. Is it divisible by 3? Okay, let's add 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 plus 4 is equal to 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. The sum is 9, so 9 divided by 3 is 3. So we can check it out. It means it is divisible by 3. Is it divisible by 6? If it is divisible by both 2 and 3, it means it is divisible by 6. Since it is an even number and is divisible by 3, then we can say that this number is also divisible by 6. Next, what is the sum of the digits? It's 9. It means this number is divisible by 9. Let us have number 3, 100,101. If you're going to add the digits, the sum is 3. It means this is divisible by 3. Is it divisible by 6? No, because it is not an even number. Next, it is not divisible by 9 because the sum is 3. It cannot be divided by 9. So that is it. And we're done. Don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time!